What's up guys? I have a couple of knives here that I wanted to compare and, and show them to you and give you, give you my thoughts on them. Um, I have, the, I have an XM18 Skinny and a Gen 2 Eclipse. Um, and I've had this one for a few weeks and I've really enjoyed it. Um, this was the this was the USA May Blade exclusive where they did the um, Skinner Skinner blade um, in a skinny profile. So um, this is the Gen 2 Eclipse, and you can see the how thick it is. That's the normal thickness of an XM18, and um, this is the thickness of a 3-inch XM18. So um, you can see they're both. Uh, pretty comparable to in size um, you'll notice that the Eclipse has about a half inch more of cutting edge because it doesn't have the forward choil um, so that's something if you want more blade edge that something that could be um, you know important to you uh, now the this uh, this is on the triway pivot system so it has the steel insert and it's running on bearings right now. This Gen 2 Eclipse is the titanium and it has Teflon washers. So, but honestly, um, this action is pretty darn good. And disengaging the lock, it feels, it feels really good. There's zero stick and I don't know how to describe the feeling of it, but when you disengage this, you kind of get you don't get the quite the smoothness as um, you do here Now that could also be because this feels like the tension is a little bit more the lock bar tension is a little bit stronger on this one for some reason I'm not getting any lock stick but um, it doesn't feel as good to disengage this lock as it does this one now also you'll notice that there's no jimping on here so that could be a reason why it feels better. Um, this one has jimping and it can get uh, irritating, irritated if you open and close it a lot. Um, there is jimping on this flipper tab. Um, it doesn't feel quite as aggressive as this. And also, if you look at the flipper tabs, you'll see that this is a bigger flipper tab than that one and so there's more area for your finger to press so it's more comfortable and then when you land you land right on smooth uh, a smooth contour and that's always the best way to land on a flipper tab is is a rounded area because it's just like um, it's just like how uh, people do how manufacturers do on the tang of a blade how they cup that and then when it hits a stop pin right there it kind of distributes the weight that's the same way this cupping does on your finger it distributes that that force out so it actually feels very good to flip um, ergos this is going to be kind of a personal opinion um, both of them are very good ergos uh, I actually had not held a full-size Eclipse I have a three inch Eclipse and your hands are kind of crowded on it so this full-size Eclipse actually fills the hand very good um, so I pref I actually prefer the ergos on this than I do here and there's jimping all along here so there's more jimping on the XM18 there's only jimping right there at the very tip so I don't I think I don't like that much jimping um, so again the, the Eclipse feels better for for that purpose too. Um, this is a very light knife. It's because the blade, uh, a lot of the steel is cut off the blade, so it almost feels like this Eclipse weighs the same as a skinny. Um, I'm sure they're very close, and now's a good time where I will put the stats of both up on the screen. You can pause and read. Um, yeah. But um, I also like how when this is closed, a lot of the blade is contained in the handle because of the because of the Bowie-shaped blade. So I like how that's in there. And 
you know. So there's the, the way the profiles look. Love both the knives. Um, both of them are great, uh, great, great knives. I think having the Eclipse, I actually prefer the Eclipse over the XM18 though. Um, but again, that's just personal preference. Um, they have a new Eclipse out with the Triway Pivot, so if you are a fan of that, you can go with the Triway Pivot. Uh, they don't have this blade shape yet, but I'm sure they will have it at some point. Um, they both have this Blue Black G10. I am getting another scale for this one, so this will be my only Blue Black G10 in the in the collection after that. But yeah, the, the way they made these old hinders are very, very good. I, I'm almost uh, a bigger fan of the, the Teflon and titanium, just straight titanium locks. It just feels so good. Um, but again, this is a skinny, so it is going to feel a little different anyway. But um, yeah, I just wanted you guys to uh, be able to check out both of these knives. Um, they're both going to be staying, and uh, I think I actually prefer the Ergos of the Eclipse more than the XM18, which was a surprise to me. But there they are, guys. Um, I will catch you on the next one.